Um, so welcome everybody. My name is Claire. If um, anybody, uh, I I'm, don't know if I know all of you yet. Maybe met many of you through the the summit. I know some of you through Energy Medicine. I know some of you. Um, I've met some of you recently through the People's Health Alliance. And please just pop into the chat and see where you're from. If you're on, um, if you're, if you're on, oh, I just got something from Liz saying check my email. Is maybe I'm not on. I can't find the Zoom link. Ah, okay, thanks, Liz. Um, the Zoom Zoom link is I put it on my. Um, I can probably I'll see if I can manage to put it on. Well, I can't put it on. There's no point in me putting it on Zoom. So, <laughs> thanks. Um, so yeah, if you if you're welcome just to pop, you've, you've very kindly said where you're from. You're welcome to pop into the um, into the chat as to how you heard about this and uh, you know how you, how you came across it, whether it was through bridging the healthcare gap or um, other you know another interest. So what I'm going to be sharing with you is just some simple techniques for, um, from energy medicine, and this is mainly with Eden Energy Medicine. And um, it's, uh, it's a modality that I've trained in, and many of you, many of the rest of you, have trained in Eden Energy Medicine. And it's a really, it's a wonderful and simple way that we can help to balance our energies no and um, just feel more, more grounded and have more vitality throughout our day. So why did I choose to do this, and why did I choose to do Energy Wednesdays? Well, a Wednesday is in the middle of the week, and sometimes it's a time that we get, you know, a little bit. A little bit tired we've just we've, we're halfway through the week and um yeah it's nice just to get a little bit of a boost personally i'm very often so i still work in the nhs and personally i'm very often on call so i was on overnight last night and i'm a little bit tired and um yeah it was like it's some i it was really something that i could i could look forward to and to to share with you so there are just some very simple principles of energy. We all know that energy is everything. It's, you know, energy is you know, all around us and that we are energy. And our energy, our energy needs space. It needs space and it needs to move. So for us to um, actually tap into the energy that we have, well, it's lovely just to, to give ourselves a little bit of space and um, to, yeah, to allow the natural energy that we've got inside ourselves to, to move. So feel free to join in with me. And um, if you can, if you can mute, that'd be great. But if you want to ask me a question and I go and see it on the chat, um, that's that's no problem either. And I, I'm just not sure if I'm on Facebook, but we're going with this just now anyway. So first of all, we are just going to stand and just stand in a nice relaxed stance Feeling our shoulders nice and relaxed. I'm seeing Fiona here, and Fiona is reminding me that we can do something else just a little bit before we um, move in with the Eden method. And this is what I learned from an amazing yoga teacher, and her name was Fiona. So, and we are going. We're going to just stand, relax our shoulders, and just take a take a couple of breaths. As we're taking these breaths, we're these these breaths. We are feeling just our our ourself just grounding down into into the earth. Feeling I don't, if you've got your shoes off, that would be wonderful. If not, don't worry. Just just feeling your your body deepening down. Into the Can you get the speaker connected? I can't hear it. My speakers aren't good enough. All right, well, you, we've got a recording, so maybe, maybe you'll be able to hear it in the recording or else you can just watch what I'm doing. So I'm going to, first of all, just be careful with your neck if you've got any stiff necks, but we're just going to turn our head clockwise first about four times and then anti-clockwise. This is opening up the joints. We'll just do a couple of these just to start off. Because our joints are often where energy gets stuck. So that's the, we've been moving our head. Now we're going to go to our shoulders and I'm bringing my shoulders up 
and back and I'm breathing and I'm smiling at the same time. So just two or three and this, if I can pronounce it right, is called Pawan Maktasna. It's opening up the joints. So that's from the shoulders. And then we're going to move to our elbows and we're going to bring energy in towards us. So just three or four times. And then bring it out. So I'm mixing and matching a little bit. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to come to behind our navel and we're going to do a, an Eden energy medicine exercise. It's called a belt flow. So this is just because as we're um, relaxing the top of our body or moving the top of our body, we then often get energy stuck in the middle. So we come from directly behind our navel and I, I, I have quite a lot of flesh round about in my navel, so I always think of this as like kneading bread. So do it two or three times and then come down and off the opposite leg and then the other side. This is all just to help to kind of open things up and help us getting moving. And then, then we can just Gently flop our arms from one side to the other. Reaching over as much as we can, just as much as we can in a gentle way. And I'm going down to my hips now, so I'll move this down slightly. So just four times in one direction and then four times in another direction. Oh, yes. And then down to our knees. So I'm putting my hands on my knees and you can modify it for whatever you can manage to do. So four times in one direction. four times in the other direction. And finally, we can go to our ankles. So four times in one direction. Always handy to do one at a time. <laughs> and then four times in the other direction. And then the other one. Just admit these. Admit. Okay. So that's that's just opening up the joints. And then now what we want to do, so we're letting space for energy to move. And we're also then now telling our energy it can cross over. Because like the DNA in every single cell, are this there's a we've got a template a you know figure of eight and it's just it's it's, it's very relaxing just being able to I, I hold a lot of tension in my shoulders so you can actually can you give your shoulders a little bit of a rub and down to the opposite hip and that not just helps well it helps every single cell but it helps with our neurological processing from um, the left brain to the right side of the body and the right brain to the left side of our body so we're now crossing over our, our energies, we've opened up our joints a little bit and we've opened up here at the, at the belt flow. So I'm sure some of you know the four thumps and um, we're going to start off with the stomach thump. So I'm just putting my hands here and um, as if you know, I'm just like a child at, at school, think, you think they're bored, putting my, my fingers on my cheekbone 
and I can give them a little bit of a tap. And what's nice when you give them a little bit of a tap, if you remember to breathe and smile and breathe and smile and if you don't like tapping them you can just hold your hands here and breathe and smile so our stomach meridian comes from our cheekbones down and right down the body and off our second toe and that's a really lovely way to ground ourselves. Imagine that if you're, we, we're, we're hungry and then we have something to eat and how well that actually grounds us. So we ground down the way, but we also take energy up and we ground up the way. And we do that by bringing energy up from the earth up to the end point of our kidney meridian. So our kidney meridian starts underneath our feet and um, between the ball of the big toe and the second toe and it comes right up to this point here just an inch underneath the collarbone and an inch out and we can tap it and we can smile and breathe and just imagine this lovely energy coming up from the base of our feet And if we don't like tapping it, we can give it a little bit of a rub. It's absolutely fine to give it a rub. Or you can even just hold it here. Hold these points here. And breathe. So, so far what we've done is that we've opened up our joints. We've crossed our energy over and we have um we did our belt flow that's just to help any energy when we're our thoughts are kind of spilling round and round and round it's just giving us a, a, an opportunity to to ground and then we tapped on our the end the, the beginning point of our stomach meridian and then on to the end point of our kidney meridian so those of you who know that the energy medicine we then go to our tapping to our thymus which helps us with our energy, with our vitality, with our immunity. Yes, you can do it like this. Or you can actually do it to the time of your heartbeat. Is he here drinking some water? And it's a love, you know, just remember to, to drink as well, take lots of it. It's very important for our bodies to be hydrated. We are 70% water, in small amounts often is much better than the huge, huge amount of volumes that may not actually get into our cells. And then the last of the four thumps is our spleen. And spleen is very much about how we nurture ourselves, how we look after ourselves. So you bring a hand just underneath your armpit and again we can tap it, we can give it some some figure of eight, some love. Can even go underneath. Don't know if there's any men here, but men have breasts too. We even go underneath our breasts. So that's we've covered the, the, the four thumps there. And you, and you don't have to see them as thumps, but they're just simply <coughs> stimulating our energy. And if you, um, we've already done the crossover shoulder pull, but now we can do a cross crawl or a variation of it and if you're not feeling like getting up and doing lots of this you can do it sitting in a chair so I'm just bringing my one my right hand over to my, my left knee my left hand over to my right knee mm. and you can make a variation of this. Mm. you can bring your, your feet up the other side. No, don't do that. what we're doing is we're just crossing our energy over and it's helping if the person who's talking could actually maybe mute that would be good and bringing in a nice
No, I decided it was a little bit too much for the first day to be putting doing this music, but I think that's what we will hope. And I would like to take little bits of the daily energy routine in our subsequent um, weeks just to focus on them. But um, hello, Raki. But um, today we're just going to just do the basics of it. Now, the next one again is really good for helping with our, our um, neurological processing. And it's in Eden Energy Medicine, it's called the Wayne Cook exercise. And Wayne Cook, he um, was actually, I think, a speech therapist and works with, worked with children who'd st who had stammering. So I'm going to do this as standing up. And I'm going to, if you see my hands here, so I've got my, my palms together. I'm going to bring one hand over and I'm going to turn my palms together with my arms crossed and I'm going to bring my hands up in front of my chest and you, you can't see them but I'm going to cross my feet over and if you can manage to do that standing up that's great and just take a nice breath and if you can't do it standing up you can do it sitting down so take a breath We help ground ourselves. Hello. Hello. There's something very special about doing this. You know, there's so many of us that do this all the time, but doing this together intentionally as a community so thank you very much for for um, coming coming here together and if anybody's on facebook thank you for joining us as well so now i'm just what i'm going to do is i'm going to bring my hands out again and i'm going to cross them the other way bring them up yeah. i'm going to uncross my feet and i'm going to cross them the other way and breathe Just do one more time. And then we're going to bring our thumbs to the top of our nose and steeple up our fingers. I know that we look really, really quite daft, but that doesn't matter. I always call this waiting for the kettle to boil. So whenever I sneak into our, our tea room at work, I'm doing this <sighs> so I can see oh there John. now Kay you told me your name earlier on I'm just going to see uh, it was down there but thank you for telling me I can see that you're now doing the next exercise which is lovely so we're going to bring our fingers to our forehead we're going to push in and pull apart and then push in and pull apart and once more push in and pull apart and we can oh jasmine i'm sorry i see that you've got covid so just take it easy but i'm sure just doing these exercises gently will will help you especially working with your kidney meridian so i'm coming round the back of my head and i'm coming around the back of my neck it's my favorite bit here as i said i have tight shoulders i'm coming down and i'm just hanging on my shoulders Somebody's I know, but it's me. Um, I'm just leaving now. It's about quarter past, so past six. If you uh, can maybe put yourself on mute, we don't want to hear your, your phone message. Thanks. Station. And um, yeah, I'm coming now. Uh, yeah, and next thing we're going to do 
is we're going to do connecting heaven and earth. So we're going to rub our hands. Lovely, thank you so much. But I just can't do another Zoom. I think. And shake them off. Rub our hands again. And putting our hands on our thighs. And breathing. Then now I'm going to bring my hands up above my head, down to the sternum. And um, Stephanie Mines and Jin Shin Tara calls this the Pam Inju. So we can just hold this for a breath. So Anjali Mudra. And then stretching up with our, our wrist bent upwards and our wrist bent down you can't see there so we're holding up reaching up to the heavens reaching up to the sky and then looking down to the earth so really seeing ourselves as a connection between heaven and earth and then bringing our hands down to the center stretching up looking down looking up down coming back to the center and we'll do it a couple more times on either side the center now I'm going to reach down and if you can manage that's great reach down to my feet and just hold them there for a breath and then I'm going to come with figure of eights right up the body And we've got two or three more exercises before we finish. I was going to wanted to keep this to just nice and short for us to do and meet meet together. So we're now going to work with our aura, and this is called the Celtic Weave exercise. So we're rubbing our hands again. We're shaking them off. We're rubbing them again. And then you can just hold your hands apart and see if you feel any heat. If you feel some tingling, you may not feel anything. And if you want, you can take your hands back in together and you can rub them together. But you, if you hold, feel that ball of energy, bring it up to your ears, almost as if putting a lampshade on top of your head. And breathe. Now I'm going to bring my elbows together, then cross, then open, and cross, and then as I come down, I open, and cross, and open, and I've got my hands moving back the way, then forward, and then I'm going to sprinkle this energy all the way down the front and the backs of my body. So I can do that again, so bring it up to my elbows. It, it, it up to my ears, sorry, and, and bring my elbows together, cross, open, cross, open, cross, open, and then we can fluff it up. You can either bring it in towards you or out, whatever you feel is what you require. And just two other little exercises we're going to put our finger into our belly button if we're not if we're all right with that push two fingers in pull push in pull up and then at above our nose push in and pull up we're going to hold and breathe One more. 
And our very last one is called a zip up. So we start at our pubic bone and we're zipping up our central meridian. We're coming once, second time, third time, and the fourth one. We can bring it up here. You can imagine this like you're making a lock. You're coming up and stretching out over your aura. So, thank you very much, everyone. I wanted to make this short. I hope it was sweet. Nothing fancy what I was offering you today. This is the basics of the, the five minute daily energy routine. Yes, we took half an hour. I added a couple of other things there, but I'm very happy and I'm committed to doing this over the summer. You may see me in different um, locations or I, you know, I'm, I'm just, I haven't planned it out. I might be at work, I might be on holiday, I might be at home, but I'm just going to bring you with me over the summer and if you would like to um, turn up, please do come along and please do tell your friends and if we want to do other things as well, we can. I might even have a guest. I, I guess presenter if anybody else wants to come and join me so thank you so much and um, please put in the comments if there's anything you want to add or um, yeah any any suggestions this is the first time I've done this so any suggestions you have gratefully received and um, if I manage to stream this onto Facebook great if not well I'll work it out for the next time and I'll send out the recording so thank you so much everyone and um, have a really lovely rest of your week. Just be gentle with yourself. You've moved some energy here. Drink some water and um, just give yourself a big pat on the back for doing this. And we'll all just give each other some figure of eights. And I'm happy for anybody who's muted to unmute so we can say goodbye. Have a lovely mm -hmm. evening, have a lovely day, have a lovely Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Claire. Thank you. Thank, Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you very much. All right. So good to be here, Claire. Love you. It was Thank great. You so much. Oh wow, Cynthia. Thank you. Yeah. Hi, we are we are three here, Claire. Oh, Thank wow. you. Fantastic. We are together here. Joanna. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Juana and Julia and Sabina. And Sabina. Oh, fantastic! <laughs> <laughs> Yay! I have, and oh, Julia, that looked like an absolutely amazing performance. So well done. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. It's good. It's good. Thanks. Sorry for joining late. No worries. No worries. Bye. Bye. Jasmine, I hope you feel better very soon. Yay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Bye, Susan. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye bye. Oh, Yulia. Oh, lovely. Hello. Hello, little one. <laughs> we just were watching you and Yay. did what we could. <laughs> Thank you so much. Nice to see you. Thank you very much. Thanks, Claire. Bye bye. See you soon. Yep. Bye bye. Bye bye. Thank bye. you. Thank you, everyone. Okay. See you next week. <laughs>